Hi guys, welcome to Code Bashers. So guys, in this particular video, I will be discussing the latest interview experience of LTI Mind Tool. And this interview experience is of 2025 batch students. So guys, as you all know that currently on campus interviews are going on for LTI Mind Tree. Okay. So make sure that you are watching this video till the end because this video will be slightly long because lot of questions were asked in this particular interview. And also uh, in the later part of the video, I will also be telling you from where to prepare for your interviews. Okay. The notes I have and I will be telling you about them also. So make sure that you are watching this video till the end. And guys, <clears throat> do subscribe our YouTube channel because lot of videos regarding different different companies, interview experiences, TCS also I will be posting in future. So make sure that you are present on this channel and you are hitting the like and subscribe button. And do join this Telegram group. Okay. The link of the Telegram group you will find in the description box as well as in the pinned comment. So do join it. Okay. For future updates. So guys, now let's start this video and do hit that like and subscribe button. Okay. So guys, the first question is introduce yourself and your academic background. So in introduce yourself, this is like, see, very important question as per your interview is concerned. Okay. So in this, you can tell about your education background. You can tell about your skills, your projects, your extracurricular activities, your internships, any achievements or research paper you have written, you can tell about that. Okay. The interview will be happy to know it. It will be a good idea to include all these things so that the interviewer gets a fair amount of idea from your introduction. Okay. And you, you can drive your interview. Moving to the next question is which programming language is your favorite? So any, you can tell, you can tell C++, Java, Python, any language you can tell. Next is write a Python program to find the GCD of two numbers. So this is the, this is the code for GCD. Okay. So you can take the screenshot for it and you can check it for yourself. Okay. Next question is what are joins in SQL? So there are main major four types of joins in SQL. There is inner join. That is when there are two tables, the common rows between those two tables will be taken out. Then there is left join. The common elements between two tables and all the rows from the left table will be taken out. In the right join, the common elements between two tables and the uh, rows in the right table will be taken out. In the full join, there will be the common rows will be taken out, the left rows will be taken out and the right rows will be taken out. Okay. I hope these joins are clear to you. Moving to the next question, explain the inner join and left join. I have already did you. Okay. I hope it is, it's understandable. Next is what is composite key in DBMS and when would you use it? So a composite key is a key consisting of two or more attributes that uniquely identify a record in a table. A compound key is composite key for which each attribute that makes up the key is foreign key of its own right. Okay. So just a simple word is composite key is made up of two or more columns so that we can uniquely identify a record in the table. So now let's move ahead in the for our next question. Okay. So guys, the next question is what is the process scheduling in operating system and why is it important? Just a second. Yeah. Okay. So process scheduling is the activity of the process manager that handles the removal of the running process from the CPU and selection of another process based on a particular strategy. So we all know that there are multiple processes running in the operating system. So there is cert certain strategy from which, which process to pick first and which process to uh, take last. Okay. So this is what a process scheduling is done in an operating system. Okay. I hope this thing is done. This question is clear. To you. Next is what is the difference between IPv4 and IPv6 IP addresses? So IPv4 has a 32 bit address length, whereas IPv6 has a 128 bit. So IPv6 is long as compared to IPv4 and multiple combinations in IPv6 are able, uh, we can support. Okay. So IPv4 end to end connection integrity is unachievable. IPv6 end to end connectivity integrity is achievable. So around two to three differences you can give to the interviewer and he will be happy to take the answer. Okay. Next question is explain what is a firewall and what it does. So in simple terms, firewall act as a gate, act as a barrier for the, for our systems and the outside world. So using firewall, we can restrict some of the users to access some of the content that we are hosting in simple terms. It is okay. It is this, I hope this is clear to you. Next question is what is abstraction in OOPS? So I have told in multiple videos that there are four pillars of OOPS and every, every pillar is important for their uh, for the interviews and every pillar you should learn in detail how to answer these oops question in detail i have made a separate video on this i will give you the link in the i button or in the description box do check them out with the help of code and different oops concepts i have i have described okay 
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वट इज अंस्ट्रक्टर इन रूप्स एंड वेन इट इज यूज सिंपल कंस्ट्रक्टर इज यूज टू इनिशलाइज एन ऑब्जेक्ट ओके देर आर डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ कंस्ट्रक्टर पैरामिटराइज कंस्ट्रक्टर डिफॉल्ट कंस्ट्रक्टर एंड कॉपी कंस्ट्रक्टर सो डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ कंस्ट्रक्टर आर प्रेजेंट एंड बाई दे आर यूज दे आर सिंपली यूज सो दैट वी कैन इनिशियलाइज एन ऑब्जेक्ट आई होप इट इज क्लियर टू यू नेक्स्ट इज नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वाई डू यू वॉन्ट टू वर्क इन एल टी आई सो गाइज बिफोर आंसरिंग दिस क्वेश्चन एंड मूविंग अ हेड सो आई हैव अर्लियर टोल्ड यू इन द वीडियो दैट वट आई विल बी डूइंग आई विल टेलिंग यू अबाउट द रिसोर्सेज फ्रॉम वेयर यू कैन प्रिपेयर फॉर योर इंटरव्यूज ओके सो ऑन आर टॉप मेड पेज ऑफ कोर बैचलर्स वी हैव इम्पॉर्टेंट इंटरव्यू आई टी सब्जेक्ट नोट्स ओके सो टिल नो टोटल सेल्स हैव बीन फोर्टीन फिफ्टी दैट इज फोर्टीन फिफ्टी स्टूडेंट्स हैव बॉट दिज नोट एंड दे हैव द रिव्यूज आर वेरी मच गुड ओके यू कैन रीड द रिव्यूज बाई योर सेल्फ द रेटिंग इज ऑल्सो गुड फोर पॉइंट थ्री आउट ऑफ फाइव and total 1450 students have already bought it so what in these notes what we have done we have covered total 12 subjects okay so in these notes 12 subject pdfs are there c++ oops questions java questions python questions dbms sql coding questions operating systems so all the subjects that are important for the interviews and the questions which are important for those subjects we have placed it in a single place okay so if i will show you a sample of let's suppose java pdf so see this so in these notes for every subject we have around 20 to 25 questions as well as their answer that you have to tell in the interview so if you will see this that what is a string pool so we have given a question we have given the answer and we have also given the piece of code so that your concepts become very clear okay so if you do not know from where you can prepare for different subjects don't go anywhere just come come and buy these notes these notes contain 12 subjects for every subject we have 20 to 25 questions and answers whether it is sql queries whether it is coding questions asked in the interviews all these important questions of every subject we have covered here and these for your notes are not only valid for lti mind to your different companies but for all the companies because questions remain same and subject remain same for all the interviews so everything is here at one place okay these are at a very nominal price of rupees 99 and the access you are getting is lifetime okay so if you are interested if you are preparing for your interviews if you want your last minute preparation strategy so you don't have to go anywhere else everything is present for every subject uh, is present in these notes only just come to our channel and it's a nominal price of rupees 99 you can purchase it and links if you are interested links of these notes you can find in the description box as well as in the pinned comment total 14 50 students have purchased these notes as of now and these are very much helpful you can read read the reviews on your own on this channel okay now let's move ahead in the video <clears throat> okay so why do you want to work in the lti so again every company will ask why do you want to work in lti why do you work in infosys tcs so the question the answer remains same that you find lot of good projects work life balance is good and uh, lti mind is a multinational company so all these type of question answers you can tell to the interview next is how do you handle constructive criticism can you provide an example so here you will have to give a real life example that where someone criticized you and you took it positively okay so it is based on your understanding next question is tell me about a time when you took initiative to solve a problem in a project so you are making your project you have made your personal project so all these things uh, any thing you were stuck in you solved it took the initiative to do it so all these things you can tell to the interviewer okay next is what does success means to you and how do you measure the success so again this question also don't have single answer it depends on your perspective and your experiences so these are all the questions which you will be answering on the fly there are no correct and wrong answers just try to be positive in every answers okay next question is how do you manage your time when working on multiple tasks so again how you are doing multitasking so you can tell that you make a proper time sheet proper uh a uh, time table that from this to this i will be working on this task then this based on priority you can sort them out okay all these type of answers you can give to the interview next question is what are your long term career goals again it's dependent on you that what are your goals next question is do you have any questions for me about the company or the role so always answer two to three questions from the interviewer it will give you it will give the interviewer good chance okay it will give that okay the candidate is seriously interested in the company so questions you can ask like uh, what will be my role what will be expectation what tech stack i will be working on so all these type of questions you can ask to the interviewer and he will be happy to answer it so these were all the questions which were asked in the mind pre interview if you want more such interview experiences already these interview experiences are present on my channel like regularly i am making videos for cognizant also uh, 
uh, mind tree also lot of videos are already there on youtube based on the experiences okay and if you and i have already told you that if you want to prepare for your interviews so these are the notes where all, all the different subjects are clubbed into a single one and for every subject 20 to 25 20 to 25 important interview questions and answers are discussed so you can check them out and they are at a very normal price of 99 the links are in the description box thank you for watching this video